Look at this. Undercover police jumped out on the brothers. Undercover police, whatever they doing down here, jumped out on these brothers in his car. Took one, one took off. Right here, undercover police. Got one brother, took off on him. They chasing another one. This guy here in the unmarked car. This guy in the unmarked car, who is he? He in the unmarked car, he in the unmarked car right here. I don't know what he doing, this blue car. This is how they do us. He, uh, he jumped out, he in the unmarked car. This is crazy. <laughs> they pulled him over, he grabbed him. Shorty just started wrestling with the police. Bro, unmarked car, man. It makes no sense at all. Just an unmarked car. I don't know what that's all about, but they jumped out, pulled him over. And then he got out the car and started wrestling with the police. Hit him, they ran. Police chase. What's up, bro? Po yeah, police chasing him. But this guy here, he an unmarked car. I don't understand what that is. How you supposed to know what's going on if somebody pulling up next to you looking like looking like they the uh just anybody the way people getting shot up in these cars. Look. So it must be obviously it's an under investigation or something. See, ain't no telling. They probably had a sting operation going on with these individuals. With the way they plant shit, and I've been through that so many times, with the way they plant shit, and have white women and white men pulling black men over, it's hard to tell what the hell's going on. But I like to be on the spot. Look. I don't know what's going on with these people, man, nowadays. The way they shoot black men. And even, even if they dealing drugs. Even if they dealing drugs, the hell, they, they talking about making weed and all this legal. What the hell? Just white men. Now what's going on? Look, so I guess he called them. Guess they called them. Look, see that? I see. I, I, I'm this. What, what they pull you over for? They didn't say. Why, why y'all pull them over? They should be able to answer that. Oh, that might you high? What's that? You got that from him? Talking about drugs. Y'all making drugs legal, right? You got unmarked cars. I run too. Shit. <laughs> What's your name? Adrian Wilson. Agent Wilson.
community policing at its finest, hear me? We have to stand and make sure our brothers aren't shot to death over no drugs or nothing, and especially when there's no guns involved. We should, you know, if you're going to arrest them, arrest them. But you got unmarked cars pulling up. Look, this is a car that pulled up on the side. Is this a sting operation? What is it? Is that legal? This dude pulled up. How you know he ain't even the police? He, Circle, he right. He's That's a police. So they obviously was watching these guys for whatever reason that is. It's ain't like nowhere in the world. But, but he pulled up. He asked him, why y'all pulling us over? And he just started wrestling with the police. The police started wrestling with him. And uh, he still hadn't told him at this point. He just pulled out, pulled out a bag of drugs saying this is why. But this is what I'm saying. You, you would end up shooting a man over some drugs that y'all about to make legal. <laughs> that makes no sense to me. Look. Look. You know, unmarked cars, commanders, all types of crap. He is a former firefighter. Yeah. I know. But this, this here, I, and you got look, she just combing. You got two white officers. It's always white officers pulling us over. Well, what makes them pull this car over opposed to other cars? Man. And transparency is everything with the way we get shot and killed. <laughs> then he got drugs in his hands or whatever that is. It looks like. A bag, a bag of, of substance, substances. But who is this guy in this blue car? That's what I'm saying. He a look, 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 man. That's what I mean. How you got but an you unmarked just, car? And you circle back. Circle and you back. Out. Who's to say? But the fact that you got you got these, and you got one brother in the back of the car. He was just a pilot. He was a driver. You got him in the back of the car. So what is he ain't being detained for? So if you got drugs off this guy, what is the other guy being detained for? Maybe you can't say he knew what he had or allegedly drugs. That's what I'm going to say. There's a guy there with the white shirt. He looked like a, uh, uh, it's easy. You could easily say you found something and, and put it on somebody. Who's to say who drugs it is? The man say he, he don't know why they would pull them over. Look, and that's another unmarked car behind him. How you even with, with the level number, with the level of shootings going on and all the stuff going on, how you know who pulling you over if it's an unmarked car? I'm not stopping. How y'all doing? This guy here jumps out of an unmarked car. This guy here. Who is he? Who the hell is he? Like he looking for drugs or something. What, you a police officer? You a police officer? You got an unmarked car. I was just wondering, are you a police?
see. Look at this. So, unmarked cars. Two unmarked cars, one behind them. Got two unmarked cars. What's that, a, a Benz? Or what kind of truck is that behind? No. It's like some type of... No. So clearly the two in the bus were in yeah, that truck. Yeah, and in then the he truck. was in that That car. one right there in that and car. Then the other so guy. they was doing some type of drugs thing. Clearly. But but when you pulling up on people in unmarked cars, it's not easy. It's not that's not safe. They got the blue and white pull up. What's your name again? Yeah. See, you can you can say anybody got drugs, cause you know the way they plant drugs on us in the '80s. I don't know what the hell going on today. See, you keep accountability. Police accountability prevents us from getting shot. Holding them accountable from the arrest. See? Look, unmarked cars, they go another. Look, they pull up on this man with two unmarked cars. How is he supposed to? Where are they going? It's an unmarked car. Look. Yeah, that's an outback. So they riding around here in unmarked cars, riding up on black men the way we getting shot out here today. So I don't know if they they took drugs from him. They took drugs from him. They show a bag, but I don't know what that is. But at the end of the day, that's what we in the discussion about having accountability. Being on the scene when police arrest brothers and I was just happy to be there. So when he took off running, wasn't no one shooting him in the back. And we got to get our organization up. We got to get our community policing up so that we can patrol them, the one, we can patrol the overseers that, that patrol us. Look, coming back up and down the street. We need to know I mean, come on, please. Like, at some point, this, I mean, 
that, him to drive up and down the street like that. That is sad. All right, man. That's it. I just want to be here, be on the scene. We on the scene. Always, every day, always. Peace.